In this Let's Play live stream at Mahjong time, we're going to be playing by Mahjong competition rules. If you are new to this game, you're going to need to play your reference. There's a link to one in the video description below. In here are the scoring elements. For Mahjong competition rules, you have to have eight points minimum to win. It's very challenging and a lot of fun and very flexible. If you'd like to try out Mahjong time, I do have 30 day VIP codes. Look for my email in the video description below and I can send you that code so you can come and try it out. Let's go live. Hi Laura, hi Marnie. Looks like we're live. And I am not frozen. It looked like I was frozen for a minute. Thanks for coming to the live stream. Hi Michelle. We're gonna be playing by Mahjong Competition Rules. Look for a link to this quick reference in the video description below if you don't know the scoring elements because we're going to be all over this card, hopefully. In this live stream, I want to focus on two things. Not dealing in, in other words, don't discard the winning tile. It's a little bit of a challenge with Mahjong competition rules because there are 81 scoring elements and it can be a challenge to figure out what your opponents are playing. The other thing that I want to focus on is tile efficiency. The most efficient tiles are four, five, six, and then moving out from there. Four, five, six are the most efficient. Three and then seven are next. Then two and eight, and then one and nine, not efficient at all. Those are edge tiles. So I want to try to work on tile efficiency. One of my viewers on another video commented about that. So I want to take it up a notch with tile efficiency. Hi, Evelyn. Welcome. OK, Julia is in the house. Julia, yep, I got it. I didn't see your name, and I remembered I remembered. Welcome, Sue. Hi, Marie. Hi, Pamela. Thanks for coming to the live stream. We're going to go ahead and join a table because there are only three tables of players right now. So we're going to play a round, and that's all we'll have time for. One round, because a round is four games. So we'll play a round. We'll see how it goes tonight. Hi, James. Oh, <laughs> I saw your comment about the quichette. I kind of, yeah, I don't know. Maybe someone else made that up, but I felt like I was making it up a word. I don't know. Those videos crack me up because <laughs> I'm very clumsy, and I'm just, you know, a housewife cooking in her kitchen. I, I don't have any training or anything with cooking. Hi, Raymond. Welcome. All right, so we're waiting for a player, and then we're going to join a table. If anybody is new to Mahjong competition rules, write hashtag new in chat. And if you have any questions about it, write your questions in caps. That way I can find it quickly as I scroll through. If you missed it, I'm going to be focusing on two things. I'm going to focus on my other objectives as a Padawan learner, and that is identify scoring elements, be ready to win in six discards, improve weights, don't deal in. Those are the Padawan objectives. But I want to put a special emphasis on tile efficiency. Okay, pound new. So James is new. Uh, Julia is new. Pamela, new. Okay, excellent. This is a style with its foundations in Cantonese Mahjong where you need four blocks and a pair. The blocks can be three in a sequence or three of a kind. Chow and Pung, respectively. No. And then the score of your hand no. depends on the components overall. So here we do have a Pung Let's see, I really wanted to focus on tile efficiency, but we have a pung and a pair. A pung and a pair. A pung of nine cracks, and then we have a pair of red dragons. 
three bamboos. Michelle is also new. All right, well, welcome. Thank you so much for coming and giving Thank this a try. You. It's a very flexible style. So uh, north is out. I'm going to discard that. North wind. So there are a couple scoring elements that we East wind. can probably qualify for right now, and that is a oh, pung of dragons. A dragon pung is two points, and then we have a pung of terminals, characters. and that's one point. But we have to have... Let's see, let's get rid of the one dot. We have to have eight points to win. So right now we only have three points in our hand. Chow. Or three, three, uh, three. Green dragon. I guess you could say there are three points. Three Seven points. Dots. The pattern or component is called a Han. I'm getting my styles three mixed characters. up. Okay, let's focus on, let's chow. Let's focus on the cracks. Chow. So we'll get rid of, oh, here we have a three, four, six, seven, two, three, four, five, six. Let's get rid of the six. Okay, there is a scoring element here called a short straight. A short straight is only one point. One bamboo. Two chows running consecutively, Southern making bamboo. a six tile straight. We could do two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two bamboos. Or you know what we could do is three, four, five and have a, a mixed double chow also. Let's get rid of the nine. nine mixed done. double chow is number 70. That's one point. Seven and done. short straight is one. One, two, three, four pair. Okay, so we, we wouldn't be able to use the dragon, though. So let's see. If we have a double chow is one, short straight yeah, is one, dragon. so that's two. Terminal pung is three. We wouldn't have enough. <laughs> so I think we're going to have to hold cracks and push a half flesh. Three dots. Half flesh is number 50, and that's six points. We're going to need cracks. There's a crack. So we're just going to hold cracks and try to do a half flush Seven and bamboo. a dragon pung. That would be eight points. West wind. And then we have a terminal pung in here, so that'll Six be another. Dots. So Seven. we have all these bams that we need to get rid of. We need only cracks and honors. Nine bamboos. Seven characters. Chow. Sometimes players will hold Long pairs jump. of dragons or valuable wins for score. So we may not ever see this red dragon. Someone else could be holding a pair with a hopeful pung. Red dragon. Oh, there we go. Let's pung. So what we need are tiles around the one and the five. We either need to pair up or we need to build a sequence. Seven dots. Even one tile will be helpful. A two crack, three crack, six, seven crack. Sound wind. Okay, so there's two. Okay, we need to get rid of these bams. Green I'm going to keep the green dragon even though there are two out. Chow. Okay, they have one, oh two, three, God. and two suits. Right now that's called a mixed double chow, one point. But if they get a two, one, two, three and cracks, that's called a mixed triple chow, and oh that's God. eight points. My God. Oh, we got a winner. Okay, 24 fawn. Oh, that's big. They have a straight. They have a pure straight. Pure straight, one through nine in one suit, all chow, which is all three in a sequence, mixed double chow, which I just explained, and then they were waiting on a single tile. So they were probably waiting to complete their pair or maybe an edge chow tile. I don't remember seeing what they had, and I did not deal in that time. So you can see the player across from us has negative 32 points. They dealt in. We have negative eight. So let's see what we can do this time. 
we have half and half. We have five cracks, five dots, two two single bands. We do have two pair in here. We do have ones and nines, four, five, six. Let's see. Let, let's get rid of the west. west let's work west. on... Let's hmm. see, we do have a pair of nines, so One we need character. to keep that in mind. Okay, let's see. Let's get rid of the eight bam. Eight bamboos. Now, we have one, three, pair of hmm. fours, six, seven. We might be able to do a pure straight. There's oh. a slight chance for that pure straight, number 28, and that is 16 Two points. Punga terminals would be another. Let's try to see if we can get a pure straight in dots. We do have all the fours. Five characters. White dragon. That might help. Let's get rid of the one. Bam. One bamboo. Hi, Marsha. Welcome. Green dragon. I'm thinking we can try to get a, a pure straight going here. And nine then maybe characters. pung the nine crack. Let's pung the nine crack. Pung. And we'll get rid of the one. One character. I want to keep the fours because there is a there is a Han called Triple Pung. Triple Pung is number thirty-two, and that is sixteen points. All right, so let's get rid of the eight crack. Eight characters. There's a pair. We can Pung. Double Pung is actually a scoring One element. Bamboo. That is only two points, though. So right now, we're only going to have, oh, look what we got. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Let's go for triple pung. One dot. Triple pung. Pungs of fours. We have all the pairs we need Eight there. Bamboos. We're going to try for triple pung instead of pure straight because yeah. we didn't have any, we didn't have a two dot or five dot. That's two, two weaknesses. But here, we're set up for triple pung. Number 32. One of these, these are both out. Let's discard those. Six bamboos. Hi, Mary. Welcome. We're trying for triple pung. All fours. None, none are out yet. Three dots. Oh, we got a pair. Okay, let's get rid of the three. Three dots. So we'll we'll see about getting rid of the six, Channel. seven, and try to pung these fours. Eight dots. We're set for Three triple pung, but a four is one of those those tiles one that are most efficient in a sequence. Four, five, because it's closest to the five. Four, five, six. Those are the most efficient tiles Seven because dots. you can build around them in any one direction. Dot. In this case, we're five we're dots. hopefully going to pung. We're going to pass. Oh my gosh, look at Seven Okay, dots. now we're going to have a little change here. One character. Let's see, there's one east out. We could Seven instead dots. play all pung. All one pung dot. is six. Okay, we're going to pass. We got the four. Okay, let's get rid of the six. six let's dots. see if we can do that triple pung. The east. Oh, shoot. I dealt in. Eight fawn. That's affordable. All types. That's why it's hard to figure out what they need. They have a chow in one suit, a pung in another suit, and I threw a six dot. That's. I mean, how can you? How can you figure that out? You can't. All right. That hand was fun to get set up, though. We were close. We were one away from ready. All right. Let's see now. We have. Oh, this is going to be rough. <laughs> we have no multiples at all. all. All single tiles, four of each suit. We have one, two, three terminals, which are ones and nines. Let's see if we can play all simples. Sounds and good. we do have four, five, six, mixed triple chow potential. Mixed triple chow. Mixed triple chow number 41 and all West simples, wind. which are two through eight. West wind. Simples are two through eight, and I believe that's only two points. Red dragon. All simples number sixty-eight. That's only two points. So we'll get rid of the ones and nines. We'll hold. We'll hold Into two through wind. eight. 
Okay, so there's a four. Red dragon. You gotta have a pair in here, so there's a four, Beast but red. I think four, five, six might work. White dragon. Eight characters. Okay. So, um, you know what? We don't want to take that because we want. Let's get rid of the nine. Nine dots. We want four, five, six because. Actually, now, Green you know dragon. what, shoot, let's see, we have a seven, and we have five, six, seven, and six, seven. We might be able to do mixed triple eight, chow eight. using five, six, seven, or six, seven, eight. So, right now, we have two Green ones dragon. that we need to get rid of. So, let's do that. Let's get rid of the one. One bamboo. So, now we have one more terminal to Green get rid of. Characters. So, we have five, six, no seven, dragon. or six, seven, eight potential here. One character. Okay, we picked up a pair. One character. So now we have three pair. East wind. Let's see. I think the Beyond two dust. bam can go next. If we pair up one more time, we could do Seven all dust. pung, all three of a kind. All pung and all simples. Oh. That would be eight points. Five dots. We kind of want that. Pung. Uh oh. Eight bamboos. Green dragon. I was hoping for a five for One maybe character. four, five, six, or five, six, seven in each suit. Five characters. Mm, our tiles are going down. Three bamboos. Okay, no, we're not taking that. White what we want is a five bam or a six bam, five, six, or eight bam, or pair up any one of these tiles and we can switch to pungs because we have three pair. If you have four pair, all pung has great potential. Four, five, six. I wouldn't commit to a chow on that because we, we have a gap. We have Nine our bams characters. are really weak for a mixed triple chow. One dot. It is pretty fast, yes. Pung. Four bamboo. Okay, it looks like they're working on. They do have West wind. dots out, but they discarded a nine dot. North. They wind. discarded a nine dot within six turns, so I don't know what they're doing. Eight they could be trying for all pung, and maybe a valued honor. One they dot. they discarded Come winds on. and dragons though, so I'm not sure what they're doing. Six dots. Oh shoot! I think we should pung. This is not pung. going. This is not going too well here. Okay, four bam was discarded. Bam We're going to try for all simples, all pung. Red so dragon. two through eight, all three of a kind. We're light on our pairs. We need two more pair. And we could be waiting on one of them. So we can pung two of these. Red dragon. Eight crack. Okay, let's get rid of the two bam. Two bamboos. So here's an eight. We do have a seven yeah. and a seven eight and a seven Four there. Characters. Eights. There are three eight bams out. So I don't think a Six triple bucks. mixed triple chow is going to be a, a good bamboos. plan. There's an there's a nine. It's out. Nine characters. Okay. Um, Julia is asking, characters. does this have a special card? There is no card, but I made this quick reference in the video description below. There's a link to One it. Bamboo. On here is all the scoring, and that takes time to memorize. So there's no card per se. You just have to know the scoring elements. All right, now let's see. We need to, let's discard five crack. Five we have our pair. We have one, two, three pair. We can pung them all. Now there's one eight crack out. So we'll see if we're going to be able to get that. Nine dots. If we can get one, oh, there's another pair. All right, we're doing good now. We have all the pairs we need for all pung and all simples. Pung. Nine bamboos. North wind. Uh, Two dots. <laughs> 81 scoring elements. Yeah, you got to memorize them all. <laughs> That's going to take a little while. Okay, we're going to pung. Pung. 
All right, now let's get rid of, let's get rid of, these are equally uh, valuable, I guess, seven dot. Oh, there's seven 37 dots. dots out, so that's a good, chow. Just, well, even though there's three out in a punk, somebody Somebody's could still chow, the player on your right. So we have a three dot, that's going to be a discard. We have three pair in here. We just need to pump, and then we'll two be ready minutes. to win on what's called a double wait, where you're waiting for any win. one of two tiles to complete a pump. Sound win. Or bamboo. Uh, yes, Marsha is talking about the green book. That's the official Two rules. Books. And there should be a link to that in the video description below also. The nice thing about that is there are pictures or, or illustrations of the hands. Nine bamboo. So there's like eight, there's examples. Because some of these are complex. And not only that, but there are nine, limitations nine, nine. and there are rules Seven where bamboo. you cannot apply certain scoring oh, elements sorry. somebody won we would have a nice little hand so let's see what they got here three seven eight nine eight nine they have they have double double mixed double chow mixed triple chow mixed triple chow all chows edge weight and flowers the flowers are bonus tiles so those are not part of your hand you cannot include those in your eight point minimum so right now, we're in last place. We need a nice big hand to get out of this hole. So right now, we have all the wins, one of each, a single dragon. We have four dots, three cracks, and a bam. So I think we should try for a half flush. Half flush. Sound win. And if we can get a north and an east, then we can get value there because the north is our seat and east is the wind of the round. East wind. There goes one of them. Oh, a seven. All right, all right. Let's get rid of the one bam. One bamboo. Marcia says this is Hong Kong on steroids. Yeah, it, it is. It's um, one bamboo. It's like uh, uh, Hong Kong Mahjong is elementary school Seven and bamboo. Mahjong competition rules is graduate school. One character. Okay, there's a dragon. We'll keep it. Any Seven pump bamboo. of dragons is two points. So dragons are valuable if you two can pair bamboos. up and pump. One dot. Red dragon. Oh, there's the first one. Someone gonna pong? Pong. Ma. Now we have to discard Side that. Because that will do us no good. You know what I was just thinking? One, two, three, four, five, six, eight seven, bamboos. eight, nine. We had nine tiles to thirteen orphans at the beginning. Four but characters. we didn't have enough of the other ones and nines to go for that. 13 orphans is a really big hand. It's an 88 point hand. That's where you have a one and a nine in each suit, one of each of the wins, nine one characters. of each of the dragons, and any tile paired. It's nine very characters. difficult. And we actually nine had nine win. tiles to that hand. I've been told nine that a good characters. guideline for that hand is 10 tiles. Three if you have 10 win. tiles from the onset, push it. Otherwise, don't risk it. Because people pung honors for value. Honors are the wins in dragons. And if you're working on that hand and someone even puts out a con, let's say, that hand is no longer viable. North win. Okay, we kind of wanted that. that. That's our seat Six win. Bamboos. There's one of each out. Chow. There's four of every tile. So we still have five bamboos. We still have a chance. Let's see. I don't. Okay, let's get rid of the two. Two characters. Six I just want to look at what's going on in discard piles. There are no dots in the discard pile for the player on my right. Three bamboo. The player across from us has no cracks in their discard pile. And the player to our left has uh, no dots. But they have a, a chow in four, five, six. Okay, four, five. Well, let's chow on that. We'll chow four, five, six. Chow. And we'll get rid of the eight. Eight characters. 
So you, you never know what they're playing. They have BAMs in their discard pile, but they have a four, five, six BAM. They could be playing all simples or maybe trying for mixed triple chow in four, five, six, except that they discarded a five crack, so I don't know. Four dot. And now they got rid of a four dot. Eight. Characters. All right, let's look at the dragons. Oh, red dragon, that needs to go. Um, let's see. Um, Sue asks, do you have Six a book you wrote? Was a teacher and recognize a good one? Oh, thank Five you very characters. much. Uh, oh, we got a keeper with that east. I have not written a, well, I sort of wrote a book, a little, a little primer, uh, I guess you could call it. It's a little booklet that comes with Mahjong sets. I wrote a book called The American Mahjong Primer uh, for uh, a company called Gammon Village, with, and they sell Mahjong, Mahjong sets. So if you get a White Swan Mahjong Mahjong set from Mahjong. Gammon Village, the little booklet that comes with it, I wrote that. But I haven't written, you know, a large, a, a regular book. That's really more like a, characters. A, a booklet, I guess you could say. Seven characters. But I would like to maybe do something like that in the future. All right, so we have another winner, and we are further in the hole. So this person has won, I think, every game. <laughs> Oh, it's over. Oh, ouch. Look, negative 52. Oh, that was painful. All right, let's go again. So we were able to get in one round in 24 minutes. So we could play two rounds in a live stream, approximately. We got close to a, a few hands, so I feel good about that. We dealt in once, I think. Um, thank you, Pamela. <laughs> um, Marie says, just joined last week. Love to learn your strategies. Thank you. Oh, we're playing. Someone's inviting me to come and play. Okay. Um, Evelyn says, I think American is your bailiwick. I do like American Mahjong. I like all the, all the versions. They all have nuances that I appreciate. Um, yeah, well, look at right here. We have a gold, a brown belt with a black stripe, and I'm a green belt. So yeah, I have a lot of a lot of work to do. That's why I call myself a Padawan learner for MCR and Ricci Mahjong. I'm just starting. I've just started to learn how to play this version. I haven't been playing I think I've been playing Mahjong competition rules for well, I don't know. I'll probably have to look at my videos to find out how long I've been playing this version. I don't not very long, relatively anyway, compared to the other versions that I play. Oh, I see. Let's see. Thank you, Evelyn. I've never heard that phrase before. Um, I admire your pluck. I've never heard that before. <laughs> so we're waiting for two more players. Let's see if we can get two more players before too long. <laughs> okay, is that like gumption? Is you know, if someone says I admire your pluck, is that like she's got gumption? And I don't even know if I pronounced that right. So another interesting thing that you'll notice about Mahjong competition rules is there are a lot of Europeans who play the game. You won't see many Americans who play Mahjong competition rules. Hopefully we'll tr get some players in. Oh, good. Here's another player. Okay, so so let's look at their info. So this player is from the Netherlands. This player, I think that's Italy. No, Mexico. Ooh, sorry. So this player is from Mexico. We have a player from Italy and then one American so far. Oh, 
Oh yeah, so you can see he's this this player plays only MCR. It looks like they've tried. It looks like they've tried to play a couple of other versions, but they they're focused on M, uh, mahjong competition rules. This player plays both uh, plays MCR primarily, but they've also dipped their toe into Hong Kong mahjong, and then of course me. You can see I'm working on. I, I'm almost a black belt, or I'm working on a black belt in uh, American, and then I'm working on all the other versions. Long way to go. I didn't notice that I had a, a brown stripe on my green belt for Ricci, so I ranked up a little bit. I wish I had more time in a day. I would love to play more Mahjong. Uh, let's see. Okay, just checking on chat. We're waiting for one more player. So we have a player from the Netherlands and a player from Mexico here. I'm 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 the green player. Very green, totally green. So let's see if we can work on some chows. Chows are the most flexible. And you want to look for repeating patterns. Repeating patterns is where you get value. Like mixed double chow, mixed triple chow, uh, pure or pure straight, short straight. There's something called terminal chows where you have one, two, three, and seven, eight, nine, the two edge chows in one suit. That's called pure pure terminal chows. So chows are supposed to be the most efficient, um, but they're of lower value typically. The other thing that I like working on is under pung chow on this player reference. Upper tiles, middle tiles, and lower tiles. Where upper tiles is all seven, eight, nine. Middle tiles is all four, five, six. And then lower tiles is all one, two, three. And then a, a step down from that would be lower four and upper four. Lower four and upper four, are, that's 12 points. And then the other ones that I mentioned earlier, just prior, those are 24 points. Maybe we can focus on opportunities for those in this next round. And they're working with puns or chows. Uh, somebody's asked, let's see, uh, Julia says, and a chow is a run in three, sequ three, three tiles. Three, four, five, yes, chow, three in a sequence. One, two, three, six, seven, eight, that's a chow in one suit. Uh, Bridget, hi Bridget, she says, is it possible for the viewer to turn off the vertical hands? Uh, no, I think it is, it's based on the player, the player's settings that they chose, and my setting has hands, so you're going to see hands in, in all the videos. But you can turn off the hands for your own experience when you play the game. Uh, let's see, Bridget says, I've been playing with the assistance of your reference and I'm enjoying the challenge. Excellent. Thanks uh, Thanks so much for breaking it down into a user-friendly and printable format. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah, there's a lot. I really had to work on arranging these scoring elements into categories that would allow me to have it on a two-page one sheet, you know. But I think it worked out pretty good and it makes sense to me. So I hope it's it's good. Um, James says I do not like the hands. Oh, the hands, the the um, animated hands, animated avatar hands, something like that. Uh, yeah, it's going to take getting used to, I think, for many people. But I, I support Mahjong Time, I support Slava and his decisions, and 
I'm sure he did not make this decision lightly. He he does have competition in the gaming community and they're all going with this same concept. So in order to continue to be a competitor, he had to improve or um, include that in this last upgrade. Yes, James, we do. We love, we love Slava. He does the best he can, I think, and he makes the best decisions for, I, this is, this is his, his baby, so. All right, we need one more player. Hopefully we'll get a player before too long. And we'll, we'll hopefully get to play four more games and maybe work on upper, middle, and lower tiles, or upper four and lower four. And incidentally, those are, I think that almost takes the pressure off when you get all those other tiles, because all you're looking for, respectively, is 7, 8, 9, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, or 1 through 4, and 6 through 9. And that's not hard. It could be mixed suits, and it could be chows or pungs. So... I think that's an easy focus. Um, Julia says, I think the gray hands are kind of funny, like a zombie or alien is playing uh, with you. I haven't noticed the color, actually. But I did get an email from tech support saying that I had a gray hand, but my hand doesn't look gray to me. Oh, we need a player. Marsha, come and play. Oh, Wesbez is here. Cool. Somebody gave up, though. That guy from the Netherlands left the table. Okay, wait, my hand is gray. My hand is gray. That's not, I don't want a gray hand. But I don't want to leave the table. I'll have to, okay, here we go. There's Marsha. Sweet. All right, we've got our players. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can focus on upper, middle, and lower tiles. Or maybe, well, we'll see. We're going to play the tiles because... Okay, look at all these wins. Oh my gosh, we're in we're in South Seat and we have a pair South. I think we should try for a half flush. Let's go for a half flush with Bams. North win. Okay, let's get rid of let's get rid of the two. Two done. We do have sevens and eights. Okay. Four done. Huh. All right, we'll South see. Win. Oh, we're gonna pong. Pong. That's two points right there. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try for half flush. Seven characters. Okay, Evelyn, you should. Um, Six dots. I think. Let me see. When is our five week month? Two characters. Next month, we're Nine gonna two. play Hong Kong Mahjong. We'll play Hong Kong Mahjong the last oh Sunday God. of the month because it's a five-week month. That's the perfect place to start. Do you play Hong Kong Mahjong, Evelyn? Five dots. Remind me. Because if you play, if you start at with Hong Kong Mahjong Channel. and then graduate to this version, Eight because Hong Kong three. Mahjong is essentially the same game, Nine but we have three. more scoring elements here. Six okay, dots. so... Play Hong Kong Mahjong um, with me um, the last Sunday of next month. We'll play Hong Kong Mahjong and we'll work on fundamentals. And that's the best place to start. And it's a very easy version. You can learn it in 15 minutes. Maybe watch my, my lesson playlist on Hong Kong Mahjong. And I believe I have a link to that lesson playlist. We have a Kong, four of a kind. Yeah, we don't need a... We don't need a one crack. One character. Oh, I see. Eight I see. Uh, eight bam. We're going to pong on that. Pong. 
Well, thank you for being Sandy willing does. to come in and play. I appreciate no, the, the thought. <laughs> but I would not want to throw you to the wolves. Six you characters. should start with Hong Kong Mahjong first. Hmm. This would be like, you know, Eight characters. playing in a, in a playground and then going into a college lecture hall Two or something. Bamboos. Because there's a, a lot of scoring elements, and some of them don't Eight make bamboos. too much sense until you have, a, you know, a frame of reference. North and North. that's why it's good to start with Hong Kong Mahjong. And that's basically four blocks and a pair, just North like here. Dragon. But there are far fewer hmm. scoring elements. Seven bamboos. Okay, we have, um, let's see, West is out. So look West at all these bams man. we have. Let's see. Here's Seven the Cantonese characters. Mahjong um, player. Oh, no, that's Taiwanese. Four bamboos. Oh, we need to pong. We'll pong. Hmm. Although I could have made that two chows. Let's, let's keep number tiles. Here's the Let's Cantonese player reference. You can see how much smaller it is. That's Pong. it compared to this. Okay. Four bamboo. MCR, HKOS. One character. Big difference. So Hong Kong Mahjong is, is the first version Pong. that you should learn for Asian styles. And then once you're comfortable with Five Hong Kong Pong. Mahjong, then graduate to Five Mahjong characters. competition rules or even Ricci. Nine characters. Um, let's Five see. Characters. Mary says, I think the hardest part about starting MCR Six is being able characters. to recognize that you have at least eight points. When that is something win. that you struggle with. Oh, green dragon. All right, we need to discard. Red dragon. That is something that I struggle with. I usually don't have enough time hmm. to figure it out. Yes, because it moves so quickly. Three bamboo. Look at all those dragons. Pong. Mm, there's a pong. That two bam not looking too good Seven right bamboos. now. And there are four, four. Uh, we have a a pong of four bams, and a four bam was discarded pong earlier. Uh, yes, I had declared a pong, One and then I drew a south and converted it to a kong. Seven characters. That's the only time you can do that. If you have an exposed pong, you have to draw the fourth tile. Or if you have three concealed three tiles, a pong, and someone discards the fourth, then you can say Kong. So we have a half flush and wind of the round here. Half flush prevalent wind is another word for it. And then we have a pure double chow. So they have seven, eight, nine, and two suits, or three consecutive pairs. That works out to a double pong, or double chow, pure double chow. Okay, so we have negative eight right now. Okay, we have lots of cracks. Oh, nice, we got some more. All right, I think we should try again for, let's see here. Oh my goodness, let's get rid of the east. east we have two, wind. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think we should try for a pure straight. One through nine in one suit. We have everything we need for it. One dot. Pure straight, number 28, 16 points. Wind. We even have a pair. There's another pair now. Let's get rid of the one. One bamboo. We'll get rid of this nine. We can do a North one, two, wind. three in the cracks. Seven, eight, nine in cracks. And then we have a pair and we just need one a three dot. dot for a chow. Unless, of course, we draw more cracks. Seven bamboos. Okay, there's another pair. Nine bamboos. Let's just see. Maybe those can help us um, get to a double weight for a win. Let's see. The animation resembles Six an automatic characters. mahjong table. The animation. Um, Three dots. Let's see. Julia is asking, Seven what do you wins. think is the most common common style played? Uh, let's see. We have a 6, 7, 4, 5. Let's get rid of the 4. Four dots. What do you think is the most common uh, played type played in Europe? I would say probably not American. No, Wind. yeah, no. American mahjong is most popular here Wind in America. Dragon. But in Europe, I would Sounds venture weird. to guess 
Richie Mahjong is probably the most popular way to play. Let's discard the seven dot. Seven dot. We have a pair and a chow. If we can seven get characters. even one of these pure straight tiles, we'll be ready to win. We need a one crack or a seven crack. Right now we're concealed, which is another scoring element, by the way. Green dragon. No, we don't need a west. We need a, a one crack dragon. or a seven crack right now. Let's Sounds see. So I, I would say that Ricci Mahjong is probably the most Nine popular characters. in Europe. Uh, we're not going to take that. We want a pure straight. Chow. Uh, White I know dragon. that some people do... Okay, now there's a four crack, but I don't think that's going to be helpful. I want to try to get this pure straight. Four characters. But I know there are groups that play Mahjong competition rules in, um, like, the Netherlands, for example. But I don't know how prevalent it is. Three dots. It's, it's MCR is also called a, a Chinese official. One This character. is the officially adopted Ten. version for all of China. Five characters. Um, uh, yeah, no, we don't need that. We need a one crack or a seven crack. White dragon. Another version that one might be dot. played uh, in in England anyway Green is dragon. a version called Western Mahjong, and that particular Nine version fingers. is also popular in Four dots. India Five and Australia. Characters. That's called Western Mahjong, and it's a combination of, it actually is a lot like uh, Wright-Patterson Mahjong. There's a flower. We can replace it. We want a seven crack, or oh, one crack. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. Okay, no, now we're ready to win on a seven crack, and we're concealed. That's another scoring element. It's, I think it's only one point. Right now we're concealed. Two points. Nine this will be a nice hand if we can get it. We need, a, we need a seven crack, and there are two out right now. West wind. So we're ready on a pure straight. Green dragon. Who knows where that seven crack is, though? There's, a, there's a discard, and there's, a check, there's one in a chow. Incidentally, those chows, that's called pure terminal chows. One, two, three, and seven, Two eight, bamboos. nine. So they could be going for, I think it's called, what is it called? Two dots. Um, oh, no, no, we don't want that. Um, Four dots. Three suited terminal chows. One bamboo. That's a big hand. Six oh, bamboo. we also have voided suit. We don't have any bams. That's called hmm. a voided suit. Two characters. So, West four peers, no, that's not the one, hold on. I'd like to draw the seven crack, Nine that's another dots. scoring element called fully North concealed. Uh, three suited terminal two chows, dots. that's where you have one, one, two, three, seven, eight, nine, and two suits with a pair of fives. That is three number 29 points. and it's 16 points. Chow. Eight no, that's not what they're going for, though. We need a seven crack. East wind. They have one, two, three, seven, eight, nine, and a two three, four, characters. five. I don't know what they're doing. All chow. But they're not going to have enough points. Six characters. One. Five dots. All right. I'm not going to try to figure it out right now. We need a seven crack. Eight bamboos. As a fresh tile. Pong. Pong is good. Nine characters. Okay, there are two seven cracks out. Cross your fingers on that seven. seven characters. There it is. Mahjong. We got one. Oh. Woohoo! And this is nice. 26 points. So we have a pure straight, one through nine, all chows, avoided suit, concealed hand, edge weight. We needed a five, six, seven. Or, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seven. A seven weight, because it's on the edge of an eight, nine. Anyway, we got one. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my goodness, this has been kind of a rough night, so I'm glad we got one. Okay, now we have a pair of East. This is the wind of the round, so we should leverage that. Let's avoid a suit. We have a pung of wind. six bams, but we could maybe Nine chow bam. those. And we do have a four, five, six here. Nine bamboos. Four, five, six. Let's keep bams. Let's just see what happens. Because we, we do have a three, four, five, six there. We have Seven a four, seven. five, six, six pair of east. Nine hmm. dots. I don't know. Chow. One character. Flower will exchange. Four dot. We paired up. Maybe we can do all pong. Okay, let's get rid of the one bam. One bamboo. Part of me is thinking we might play all simples. That's only six points, though. Three characters. All simples voided suit and our weight. Three dots. All simples is two. Eight characters. There's a three. Let's get rid of the north. North wind. Let's see. All simples is only two points. Eight dots. And we only have two Now. pair. We have a pung and a pair. Eight bamboo. Maybe we could stay concealed. Two That's bamboos. four points. We would need two more points somewhere else. Let's stick with voided suit Seven too. Seven characters. Uh, James is asking. I'm guessing there are no jokers. No, there are jokers in very few versions of mahjong. Uh, Filipino Two. mahjong, Vietnamese. Five I think Malaysian bamboos. mahjong. An American Green Mahjong. Green. I think that's it in regards to Jokers. Green Dragon. That I'm aware of. Only four versions. Red Dragon. Correct me if I'm wrong if somebody else in the room knows. Flowers are worth points but not part of the hand. That's correct. Flowers are bonus. Sounds so those weird. are counted after your score. So it looks like we're working. Let's, let's go for... Oh my gosh. Let's get rid of the east. East wind. Oh, that's a scoring element, but we can also maybe do all simples here. Six all simples. Characters. We have five, six, seven, four, Two five, six. Characters. We could maybe do mixed double chow, all simples, four and then moves. and then look for a good weight. Let's let's chow four, five, six. Because we have a four, five, six already in dots. That's East a wind. mixed double chow. Mixed double chow is one point. All simples is two, so that's three. Voided suit is one, so that's four. One Our bamboo. weight could be one, so that's five. We need more. Hmm. We need more. Four, five, six. Two dots. Four, five, six, seven. Three bamboos. Let's see. One, two, three. No, because we want all simples. Five characters. I don't know. We might need to. One, two, three. Let's get rid of the three bam. Three bamboos. Because we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and an eight. One dot. If we can get a nine Red dot. Dragon. Oh, there are three seven dots out and a nine dot. I was thinking maybe we could try for a pure straight again. Three characters. Okay, there's pair. Oh my gosh, this is not going well now. Oh no. Let's get rid of oh let's get rid of the eight. Eight dot. Shoot. We have we don't have enough points. I think we're gonna need to get rid of One this. Dot. So we'll pass. Simples is two through eight. Eight bamboos. Numbers two through eight are called simples. Four characters. Okay, there's a four. Let's get rid of the one. one dot. Maybe we can get four, five, six in another suit for a mixed triple Seven chow. Characters. Four, five, six in each suit. We have a four, five, six in dots, chow. and we have a four crack here. If we can four get a five crack or a six crack, we'll be looking one good for a mixed triple chow. There's a seven. One dot. Okay. Uh, not characters. one, two, three dots, just a pair and a four pair Five and dots. four pair. Let's see. Red um, hold on one second. Let's see. 
west wind. So Julia, not a one, two, three dots and one Nine pair character. and four pair. I don't understand. One character. Julia, what do you mean? Uh, let's see. West wind. So the player across from us, there's another. Huh? Let's Seven see, four, characters. five, six. We have a pair of fours. We could do all simples, all chow, mixed double Five chow. Dots. Let's see, all simples is two. Five mixed dots. double chow is another one. Nine bamboos. And then voided suit is Seven one. Wind. And then two characters. Let's see, two, three. All chow is one. That's four. Seven characters. And then our weight is five. We're short. North wind. Green okay, dragon. let's see. Uh, Julie says, I thought you said you had one, two, three, four two dot dots. and didn't have the two. We had a pair of West ones wind. and then a, um, no two dot and then we had a three and then here we have a four, five, six and we also had an eight two dot because I was thinking maybe we could do a pure straight but there, there, there were three seven dots already nine out dots. and two nine two dots bamboos. were out so I just didn't think that that was going to come in. What we really want here is a five Three crack dragons. or a six crack and there's one of each out right now because we have a four five six we have a pair of fours and a pair of sixes. The seven bam and the three dot two can dots. go away if we can get a five crack or a four six bamboos. crack. Okay, there's another pair. <laughs> That's not helpful though. So we have four. Let's get rid of the three dot. Three dots. If we can Come get on. a five crack or a six crack, we'll be ready to win. No, we won't. We'll be one away. Two dots. Eight crack. No, we don't Eight need that. Characters. Let's see, five crack. There are two out now. Four yeah, characters. that was discarded a minute ago. Oh, someone won. Okay, let's see what they have. 19, pure straight. They got a pure straight in their cracks. They voided a suit, so they have no bams. They have a mixed double chow, so two chows that are the same in two suits, and they have a flower. And we are in second place because we won a hand. Usually if you win, that helps. There is seven pair, but it's hard to get. Seven pair is number 19, and that's 24 points, and it's concealed. All right, so here we have five, seven, pair seven, bam, six, seven yes, in yes. cracks, one, four, six, nine. We have five, six, seven, potential mixed triple chow. Yes, We're in West yes. Seat. We have a pair of Souths, so already we have to make a choice. Let's get rid of West. West wind. There are two out already. One bamboo. So, Chow. I'm thinking of keeping five, five, six, one seven. Dragon. Focus on five, six, seven mixed triple Chow. White dragon. There's a seven. We already have a seven. Okay, let's let's see. We have two sevens. Let's get rid of the one dot. One we have dot. three pair right now, and we have two sevens in pairs. We could do double pung. Double pung is two points. Six bamboos. Pung of pung of honors, which are wings or dragons. Yeah. Well, really, a, a non-value seat is one point. Four dots. There's a pung. Okay, three, four. Uh, let's get rid of. Let's get rid of the nine. Nine dots. So we have a, a concealed pung. Two characters. Well, atomic is actually a Cantonese three hand. Dots. Atomic is when Two American mahjong players will play an off card hand, and they are they are Cantonese mahjong hands. Or Hong Kong Mahjong six hands, characters. which is Chow. in both versions, but you can play seven unique Eight pair, dots. and I think some groups Chow. allow for a Kong, and then you could also nine play all characters. Pong, all three of a kind. Oh, we, ah, I discarded nine a nine dots. dot. So yeah, that's Atomic. There, I call it a Cantonese nine sampler characters. for American Mahjong. 
Six because nine. the hands are borrowed from Cantonese mahjong. One bamboo. Okay, there's a five. We yeah, that's not necessarily helpful though, unless we do that mixed right triple in. chow. If we can make it work, hmm. mixed triple chow five six seven in three seats. Eight characters. We're going to try for a mixed characters. triple chow. Five, six, seven, and three suits. Red dragon. Okay, let's just keep number tiles. We have a pair there. Let's get rid of the three crack. Three characters. We have a pair with the seven bam and a pair with the south. Although if we get rid of the Six south, characters. that's another scoring element. No Nine honors. Dust. But it is a pair. Green dragon. Okay, there's an eight. Five, six, seven. Six. Uh, let's get rid of the eight. Eight characters. I want to try to make five, six, seven work, and we could seven maybe hold three. the south as a pair. Let's see. No, if we go for it, let's pung. Hmm. Let's pung and do five, six, seven. We still need a pair in here. Let's get rid of the seven crack. Seven characters. We have a pair of seven bands. So what we need right now is Nine a six band, five crack, and seven dot. Seven dots. Okay, there we go. We'll chow. Chow. Okay, now we have a pair. We have our chows, so we're going to get rid of the three, four. Four dots. We're looking for five, six, seven, chow. We have our pair in the seven bands. So we need a five crack and a six band. Chow. White dragon. Oh, nice. Evelyn. Oh, shoot. We got a winner. Oh, I wanted to win that one. All right, 10 points. Mix shifted chows. This is where your chows are in different suits and they're one up from the other. So they have one, two, three in one suit. Let's see here. Wait. They have, okay, they have three, four, five. No, they have. Four, five, six, six, seven, eight. Oh my gosh, it's kind of hard to figure out. There's a five, six, seven, and then a six, seven, eight, and a, a four, five, six. Four, five, six, five, six, seven, six, seven, eight. There it is. Bams, cracks, dots. That's mixed shifted chows, one up from the other. And then they have all chows and a short straight. One, two, three, four, five, six and they self-picked. So that was their score. That was the last round for the live stream. And I forgot to check what place we were in. I just lost that view. I forgot to look. Shoot. All right, I'll figure it out in the repost. Thank you so much for coming to this live stream. It's always fun. I always have a good time in these live streams. And thank you for being brave in checking out a new version. So I know it can be overwhelming, all the scoring elements. <laughs> yeah, it is hard. Oh, we got second place. Okay, cool. That makes me feel a little better than the first round. So we, when you win at least one, you have a chance at placing first or second. Okay, James says, confusing and exciting. Yep, that's Mahjong. <laughs> Thank you, James. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos or when I go live. And you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next live stream, may all your picks be keepers.